The Frederick Ferris Thompson Memorial Library dates to 1905 and is the main library on campus. Every student will likely spend time here. Vassar's libraries have more than 1 million volumes in print, including over 50,000 rare books. That's 14 miles of stacks, plus online resources. If those aren't enough, Vassar participates in two interlibrary loan systems so that students can check out books from other institutions. The 150,000-square-foot building is consistently ranked one of America's most beautiful college libraries. The entrance resembles a medieval castle gate, and the entrance hall has a high ceiling, hanging tapestries, and a fireplace. Its Gothic-style tower is perhaps the main symbol of the Vassar skyline. The library has been expanded and renovated several times over the past century. It's got big tables where students can study with friends and plenty of armchairs and nooks for quieter work. The main library has a staff of full-time research librarians available for students every weekday by walk-in or appointment. Every department and program also has a designated librarian. The main library is just one of four libraries on campus. The Archives and Special Collections Library lets visitors handle fragile materials, such as letters from Albert Einstein and a French book of hours from the 15th century. Connected to the main library is the Van Ingen Art Library, which supports the art department. There is also the George Sherman Dickinson Music Library, which has almost 76,000 items across five levels and historical musical instruments like one of the oldest playable harpsichords in the United States. The ornately decorated Class of 1951 reading room is the main library's periodical room. It is also the site of lectures and talks. Other spaces in the main library include an after-hour study area that is open 24-7. There is also the library quiet room in the library tower, where the Office of Religious and Spiritual Life and Contemplative Practices hosts meditation sessions. The breathtaking stained glass window inside the main library depicts Elena Lucrezia Cornaro Piscopia defending her thesis at the University of Padua in 1678. She was the first woman to ever receive a doctorate. The window celebrates the pivotal moment in women's education. Cornaro appears wearing the original Vassar colors of rose and gray.